Hi, Moon. Hello, Mars. Hello, everybody. Hold me close till I get up. Time is barely on our side. I don't want to waste what's left. The storms we chase are leading us. And love is all we'll ever trust. Yeah. No, I don't want to waste what's left. And I We'll go through the wastelands, through the highways, till my shadow turns to sun rays. And on and on, we'll go through the wastelands, through the highways. And on and on, we'll go. What is up, everybody, and welcome to the stream. This is Deputy Ketchup coming at you live with some OCRP in the building. I hope everybody is having a great night. Uh, that was the end of the song, basically. That's our team motive in the building. What is up, Ami? Thank you so much for saying the Q word. Tate in the building. Yo, what up, everybody? Hope everybody is doing well. Welcome on into the stream. How does my voice sound? I had to turn down my voice down a little bit. Um, actually, I gotta turn it up a little bit, but I'm gonna turn it down on my OBS side so that way it's not as loud. I noticed the other day whenever I was recording with, uh, I was in the recording server and I watched Jeff's streams back and mine, and I was just insanely loud for some reason. So we're just gonna try and tone it down a little bit, just a little bit. Um, yes, I saw you beat Mars. I was watching live chat before we came in. Um, I saw that. Crazy. And shout out to Mars. I'm sorry you didn't get your slushy, but um, at least you got a popsicle, so that's something. Only five days till I turn 20 years old, dude. Hell yes, I'm so happy for you. Happy early birthday if you don't make it out. Um, so yeah, let's go ahead and get on patrol here. Looks like I'm the only LEO in a sea of uh, looks like six sieves, and I'm the only LEO. So you know, we're just kind of chilling. Let's bring down the music volume a little bit. Get on out there into the world of OCRP. My game is lagging already. That's not a good sign. Um, I may have to cash my server like every time I get in for some reason. That or like I'm gonna have to like. Uh, so medic the other day said that uh said that uh he 
updated his NVE and I think his reshade and that helped so I might have to try that out as well um, I won't lie my NVE is a little bit out of date so we might look into an update for NVE maybe that might help that song is a banger and I do like that song you know what let me get y'all the link to that song in case you want to add it to your Spotify I'll get that song real quick for you it's by Cartoon, who, um, actually, you know what, crazy enough, um, I didn't, I didn't even know, but Cartoon, I believe, is the same people that do, um, that do Bay Area Bugs' intro as well. That do so, Bay Area Bugs' oops, intro, is just mute myself up. So, uh, damn, that is extremely low latency, that is crazy. So there's the song. It's called On and On by Cartoon and Jaja. Um, really cool song. I actually really do enjoy it. You sure I can prepare to the thing it was on? Um, I like to stay moon only be because I was still... Uh-huh. Okay. All right. Hey, it's okay. You know, you can't be first all the time, you know? Sometimes you gotta, you know... Sometimes you're second. Sometimes you're third. But it, the, the thing that matters the most is that you were here. That's what matters the most. So, um, here's some plans for tonight. I am thinking about bringing out Arthur, I think, <laughs> really? Think about bringing out Arthur Bennett, and I'm thinking about opening up the Yellow Jack. The Yellow Jack has not been opened in such a long time. Um, it used to be popping. Like, the Yellow Jack used to be pretty popping. So, we'll get the Yellow Jack open. We'll do maybe some chill sieve stuff. Right now, I'm going to be LEO because, you know, there's civs in server, and I'm the only person in server, uh, besides two people who can go LEO. But there's no LEO, so we'll go ahead and give these guys a little bit of something to do. Has over a million views on YouTube? Really? I did not know that. Like I said, I've never, I didn't even know about that song. I didn't even know about Cartoon until, um, I started to say, oh, great started listening to non-copyright music and that's how I found out about it. Um, so, I'm gonna post up here for a minute. Hopefully our frames will catch up with us. Cause um, yeah, my frames are just taking a big old poop. So yeah, Um, bring up the face cam. What is up everybody, gang gang in the building? Um, yes, I hit over 700. So, um, Thank y'all so much for that. That's freaking... Doesn't Peach's character Bryce own it? So, yes, but at the same time, um, so one thing they've made pretty clear is that, like, you know, nobody can own a certain business or anything like that. Um, so, yeah, uh, nobody can really own a business. It's open to anybody who wants to RP with it. But not only that, but um, Mars... I mean, uh, not Mars. Sorry, I was looking at Mars. Um... Not only that, but Peach hasn't really done RP over there in a while. Um, basically, since, like, you know, Old Man Beardface kind of left, you know. Um, it kind of died down a little bit. So, um, I'm definitely I'm definitely down to bring it back. Most of the time, people are in the county. You know, you get an old man that works there. You know, he's all nice and innocent. You know, he talks like this and he's, he doesn't know what's going on. And, um, who knows? Maybe we can get Drew in there, like, with Orson as his old face. As, as his old face. As his old character. Um, so that'd be pretty cool. Yes, I gotta get to 1K. That's for sure. I do mess uh, Dude, yes. So, um, Old Man Beardface decided to take his channel in a little bit different of a direction. He's focusing on other things. I'm not gonna speak on his behalf, but that's what I saw in his Discord, at least. That he's kinda, he's kinda taking his channel to a different area. Um, which, dude, that's totally cool. He put, he was pumping out some freaking amazing content whenever he was in OCRP. And he was one of my favorite OCRP YouTubers to watch just because his editing was fucking insane. But somebody who you should look out for, who is also on the rise, kind of has a similar editing taste, is um, Vince Tuttle. T-U... T T L E and you can find his link down below in the description of my channel or of this video 
and uh, you can find you can find Vince's channel down there as well. He does a lot of the editing. Like, dude, he he spent weeks on top of weeks on top of weeks to try and get um, a bunch of really cool edited videos out um, to try and get those out for y'all. And he does them every week, every Monday. He comes out with a new video, so be sure to go check out Vince as well. Vince is freaking good, dude. Um, so yeah. But um, anyway, so to start off the night, we're going to be doing a little bit of LEO, just a couple hours, and then um, maybe like an hour or two, and then uh, we'll, we will uh, jump into Arthur Bennett. I think that's his name. Arthur Bennett, right? Let me just double check. Yeah, Arthur Bennett. We'll jump into Arthur Bennett, the old man, open up the Yellow Jack, get some Yellow Jack RP going, because nobody ever goes to Yellow Jack. So that'd be pretty cool to do. I don't think the yellow jack has a. Oh no, I got it. Okay, come on, work your freaking fingers there. Um. Oh, yo, the yellow jack does have advertisements. Okay, cool. So later on, we'll post a yellow jack advertisement. Let them know, hey, yellow jack's open for business. Grand reopening. You know, first first beer is free or something. We'll do that, and we'll get we'll get people over there for sure for the first beer. Um, you know, we'll do pool games are free all night, stuff like that. I don't know if you could play. You know, what? Oh, shit, we're not doing anything. We're just sitting here. Let's go check to see if darts works over there. Just cruise as a casual forty five miles per hour. Nerdy also has a bit odd wall. Yes. I don't know where Nerdy went. I haven't seen her in a while either, though. I'll tell you who was playing a fun game the other day was uh M, M G. She was freaking. She was playing some type of uh, like escape room game. It looked really cool. Um, I wonder if that game is multiplayer. If that game is multiplayer, that'd be a really cool game to play with uh with M. Cause I like escape rooms. They got an es okay. They got an escape room actually about 30 minutes away from me, and I really want to go try it out. But um, I don't want to go by myself, so I got to get a group of coworkers to go try it out. Maybe do some like uh, maybe do like a team building or something. I think that'd be pretty cool. Oh my gosh, it is popping over here at the Yellow Jack. What the fuck? Watch there be people already in here and shit. <laughs> oh, it's lagging. It's got to load in for a minute. Hold on. Can you play the darts? You can play darts. You can play darts. Okay, that's cool. So you can play darts. So we'll do darts and pool is free tonight. And we'll do uh, first beer is on us. How about that? Or first drink in case people want to get like liquor or something. Um, I am doing a little bit of drinking tonight. So bear with me. Um, but I think it's going to be pretty cool to do that. The Yellow Jack hasn't been opened in a while. And I think it's a good way to start a grand new opening. And uh, let them know that it's under new management. Free! Everybody likes free stuff, right? Come on. It's free stuff. Who doesn't like free stuff? We know who does like free stuff. Bugs. <laughs> Bu Bugs would give his fucking... Bugs gives away his social security and bank account information for anything free. If you don't know what I'm talking about, go watch Bugs' recent video about his stolen identity. Not, uh, not, not, the, not the new George... Um, not the new George, uh, Georginator one, but uh, the the stolen identity one. If you don't know what I'm talking about, go watch that video from Bugs, and um, you, you'll know what I'm talking about about the free stuff. Anyways, how was everybody's week? Everybody, we made it to Friday. Let's go. I still insert. Why? Okay, yeah, you can say it. It's all right. I'm only gonna be LEO for like an hour and a half, so you could say it. Don't you know? That's fine. Um, back in 40 minutes, no doubt, Mars. We'll be right here chilling. 
Um, FYI stream, new game comes out tomorrow. I'm thinking about starting up a little bit earlier than usual, maybe around like one or two, possibly a 12 hour stream, maybe. We will see. Just depends on how the gameplay goes and how everybody else is uh, rolling through. <laughs> and then I'm gonna miss something good, you ain't lying. All right, we won't say it then. I got you. But um, yeah, so we will definitely um, try and do a 12 hour stream tomorrow. I'm not gonna guarantee anything. I won't say yes, it's gonna be for sure, 12 hour stream. But um, with the new game and everything, we might try it out and do it. Do a, uh, I will go ahead and I'll just go ahead and tell you, it's Red Dead Redemption 2. Um, we are bringing RDR2 to the channel. We're gonna do a quick little, you know, playthrough of that and have some fun with it. What the fuck are you doing? Um, we'll have some fun with some RDR2 and uh, see, see if we can get into that game. Life is Strange is definitely coming back. Mars did ask me about Life is Strange. It will be back. I promise you that. Um, so we will be doing some streams of those as well. I. I kind of want to restart the series from the start so that way I can, you know, record it and then maybe make some videos of that. That'd be pretty cool. Get the fuck out. Are you serious? The Q word is the quiet. Quiet. Um, so there's, there's this superstition with law enforcement that if you say quiet or it's been a it's been a quiet night or you know it's been slow another slow s word is another one slow um it's superstition in the police community community that if you say stuff like that shit's gonna pop off basically it's gonna go crazy so um that's why she doesn't want me to say it because she doesn't want to miss anything red dead redemption 3 would be so lit if they're making that um I'm very happy with that. Um, I played probably about maybe halfway to three quarters of the way through on Red Dead Redemption 1. Which, by the way, that will be coming after Red Dead Redemption 2. Apparently, and I didn't know this, apparently Red Dead Redemption 2 is actually a, uh, a prequel to uh, Red Dead Redemption 1. So the way I want to play it is maybe Red Dead Redemption 2 first, then go back down to Red Dead Redemption 1. Um, yeah, you better stop. 30, 30, 30, 30, 30. Showing you 10, 37, 10, 8 at 1,800 hours. Correction, 1,900 hours. Correction, 2018 hours. Oh, uh, yeah. Sorry, I'm, I'm on Central. Um, so, anyway, what was I saying? Um, oh, yeah. Um, yeah. So, oh, um, Red Dead Redemption 2 is unfortunately, um, not on i mean red dead redemption one is unfortunately not on pc so um i will be borrowing my my roommate's xbox so shout out to my roommate ultimate rig gaming um he's gonna let me borrow his xbox and uh his stream capture card as well so that way we can uh we can play red dead redemption one on stream as well so um i think that's gonna be pretty cool so look out for that as well Crazy ass local. So, anyways, there's that coming up. I'm new to this, so I have no clue what's going on. Yeah. And the game will be set in the 1920s. You'll play as John Marshall. Something. You're shitting. Yo, that. Okay. All right. I feel like you're saying this, but I don't have. I'm. I haven't seen anything about it. If that is true, that's gonna be so cool. That's gonna be so cool. Cause I. I like. Personally, I like John John Marston's character. He is so freaking, he's lit. I like John Marston. Um, as far as Red Dead Redemption 2, I played a little bit of it. 
Um, Red Dead 2 is new. Didn't it come out like six? Um, yeah, it did. It's not new, but it's new to the channel. What up, Nero in the building? What's up? Welcome on in. Uh, Red Dead 2 is not new by at all, by any means. But, um, it'll be new to the channel. So, yeah, we're gonna play RDR 2 first. And then, um, we'll bring in RDR 1. <clears throat> oh. Oh, of course. Are you gonna you better stop soon. Gonna get a cookie? Well grab me one too. What the hell? <laughs> grab me one too. Don't be stingy. What kind of cookie do you got? Nero's like everybody knows Nero. Nero's always always stream hopping. I appreciate you coming in and hanging out. Also, uh, Drew at Derailed Gaming is gonna be uh, or he actually I think he is live already. He's live as well. And him and 038, which is Medic, are doing something. I'm not sure what they're doing, but uh, I think they're doing something. Who knows? They're uh, they're definitely doing something though. We'll uh we'll also put my name as nine one one up in the uh in TeamSpeak so that way if anybody does want nine one one they can just tag me. Um so we'll do that. So just in case anybody wants to do nine one one they can uh <laughs> They're probably like, what the fuck? Okay, alright. That's legit. <laughs> Anyways, uh, I'm going to work tonight, so be on late, please. Um, we will see. Mm, I got a haircut appointment tomorrow at 10.45 a.m. But, uh, other than that, yeah. What time do you get off, Ami? I don't know what time I'm going to be on till. Still not sure. We'll, uh, we'll keep going until the beer runs out. How about that? <laughs> Met Nero on Marge's channel. Yes. Special units, Shut dispatch up. operator 110, 1037 tonight. Oh, perfect. I'm not to take nine one ones. Thank you. Well, there we go. There goes our uh, dispatcher. 110 a.m. Eastern? God damn. Oh, Pacific. Oh. Oh, that's not too bad. That's, um... What? 11.10? For me? That's not bad. Yeah, I'll probably be on. Who knows? If not, there's always tomorrow. Like I said, I'm trying to do 12 hours tomorrow. We'll see. No guarantees. No guarantees. But we'll see. We'll see what happens. Like I said, we're going to start the new game tomorrow. And the thing is... The thing... Oh, you're off tomorrow? So? Oh, perfect. Hell yeah. Well, I hope to see you in here tomorrow as well, Ami. Um, the thing is, with Red Dead Redemption, it's such a long game. Um, it's such a long story-based game that, you know, it's going to take a lot of time to go through it. So I'm thinking, like, maybe four hours, four hours on Red Dead, four hours on The Last of Us, and then, you know, the last four on, uh, on OCRP. Or just in the night on OCRP, whatever. Ooh, nom 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 nom. Chocolate chip is freaking good. That's my favorite. You know what? 
You know who has the best chocolate chips? Jimmy John's. I don't care what you say. Jimmy John's has got like the best chocolate chips because they got, they got like milk chocolate and then they got white chocolate and they're nice and soft. It's like, oh God. Watch out for Cookie Monster. <laughs> who's all on server tonight? Um, So we got Bradley who's doing dispatch. Shannon and Bo are both setting up. So we got 445, 039, and 33 all setting up. We do have eight sieves in. Uh, we got Troy. Troy is here. We got Drew. We got uh, Andrew Mason. Mason is in as well. Uh, Garrett F. Okay. Uh, so yeah, we got we got a pretty pretty decent amount so far. Uh, we'll see what the night brings us for sure. Right now we're just kind of chilling, so we're just kind of chilling. See what? It, do I have a? You already know. You already know. Do I have a favorite? Look at that. Look at that. You already know. H Town, hold it down. H Town, Q Stone, representing. That's what I do. Um, even though we're not, even though we're not looking that good so far this year, um, but I mean, yeah, H Town hold it down. Houston Astros, hands down, favorite baseball team. I like beer too, Nero. That's why I'm drinking beer. Ew! Get the fuck out of here, New York Yankees fans. Get the fuck. Oh my god! How can you say that? How are you gonna come into my chat and tell me you're a Yankees fan? Come on, bro. <laughs> um, nah, that's cool, man. The Yankees, um, the Yankees fucking sweeped our ass, dude. They kicked our ass in that series. I'm not gonna lie. Um, but I mean, dude. So Astros haven't looked. Astros haven't looked too good. But um, I mean, they got off to a bad start. Okay, I'll say that. They got off to a bad start. They had a seven-game seven game series, one day off. Then they had, like, a 14 or 15-game series with one day off. And then I think they're playing right now, actually, as a matter of fact. I think they're playing right now. Or they're supposed to be. What's today? The 19th? 545 so the game's probably over i don't even know what the score was i guess we could always look that up but um tell matt to unhide me on march's channel oh that's nero for nero uh that's on marge um not sure what i could do for that san francisco giants how are they doing this year i haven't even i haven't even I totally forgot about San Francisco. Um, how are they doing this year, Ami? Better than the Orange. Get the fuck out of here. Astros are the best team. Let's be real. Come on. And if I hear anybody talk about some fucking cheaters, we're going to fight. I will find you, and we will fight. <laughs> nah, y'all can talk shit all you want, dude. We got caught. You know, it is what it is. It is pretty damn embarrassing. I can't say shit. It's embarrassing, but. What am I drinking? I am drinking Corona Extra. The actual original Corona. The only good Corona. Because Corona Premieres taste weird to me. <laughs> it's all good, Moon. Plenty other things we could talk about. Dance. What is, okay, I got a question. We'll do the last, god damn. Really? We'll do the last 10 years. What is the most iconic dance move in the last 10 years? Or you know, we'll take it all the way back to Soldier Boy. Okay, all right, from Soldier Boy's Superman on up From soldier boy Superman on up What is the best dance move or dance uh, I don't even know how to 
I don't even know what to call it. Dance, uh, what's the best dance routine or whatever? I, I, I don't even know what, to, I don't even know what to call it at that point. Damn, I gotta think. I know, that's what I'm saying. The historic Houston Astrodome was the original home of the Astro from 1965 to 2000. That is correct. The eighth wonder of the, oh, I'm driving around with no headlights like an idiot. The eighth wonder of the world. The eighth wonder of the world, the Houston Astrodome. Don't worry, dude, I'm not pulling you over. Even though you are going like 16 miles an hour. This has got to be a local. Hey, how's it going? This has got to be a local. Oh, God damn it. Right in front of everybody. Of course, it happened in front of the bus. <laughs> that you have done, or, or, okay, so I have to think to each, which genre, like hip hop or jazz, which I, just, um, okay, so we'll do like hip hop and rap. How about that? Like Soldier Boy is like hip hop rap. There's not even a freaking rock there. There's there's no rock there, right? What the? F That's so weird. There's an invisible wall or something right there. That's weird. That's weird. Um, this might take a while. <laughs> so yeah. Anyways, um, question. So, from Soldier Boys, you, um. Since then, up till now, what is the best dance move? I'm very interested to see what people say. That is facts. And you know what? I can tell you right now, there is a lot of people in Houston that are kind of pissed about that. Um... A lot of people are pissed about that because they're paying their tax money into keeping that building um the moonwalk well no because the moonwalk was michael jackson that was way before way before the soldier boy way before superman by soldier boy i mean you got like so you got superman you got um the, the Cupid Shuffle, the Cha Cha Slide, I think, was in there. Um, you got Cotton Eye Joe, um, the Jerk. I mean, there's all kinds of different. Uh, Teach Me How to Dougie. 
uh, the Dougie. Um, I mean, there's all kinds of different songs in there that you can that you can choose from. Anyways, yeah, a lot of people are from Houston are kind of pissed about that. Soldier Boy is the most iconic. Oh, so like I used to get down. I used to get down on the dance floor. <laughs> no, not really. I did not dance at all. I did not dance. I was such a horrible dancer. I did not know any of the songs. I know the songs because I used to be a DJ. So I used to be a DJ. So I know the songs, but I don't know the dances. Like I know the Cupid. Ch no, I don't. Well, I mean, yeah, I know the. Oh, the wobble. The wobble's another one. <laughs> I forgot about the wobble. I know the wobble. Um, the Cupid Shuffle, I think. Cha-Cha Slide. And um, what's that other one? I don't know. There's, there's another one that I totally forgot about. Who doesn't know the Cupid Shuffle? That's, dude, I'll tell you right now. If you, uh... If you want to, uh, so what kind of music do you listen to, Moon? I'm actually curious about that now. Um, so let's be real. Cupid Shuffle and the Cha Cha Slide, if you see that your dance floor is starting to dwindle off, or if there's been a decent amount of time where, like, it's chill and everybody kind of gets, uh, everybody kind of gets, like, a break from dancing to kind of, like, chill for a minute, you bring in the Cupid Shuffle or the Cha Cha Slide. And it just flocks people to the dance floor every time. How are we doing on early? Uh, still got, still got a couple that aren't. Thirty-three county. <sighs> Go ahead. Confirming your uh, Sultan six. No, hold on. I got you. Three, two, two, Soldier. control. Three, twenty two, go ahead. Uh, are you still getting set up? Uh, negative at this time. I'm going to be 10 8. 10 4. You're not showing in CAD. Hey. Oh, am I not? Negative. Zero zero three nine. Zero three nine. What the uh, fuck? Show me. Uh, ten thirty seven tonight. Zero three nine. Got you ten thirty seven tonight. Twenty thirty seven. Good evening. Good evening to you, sir. Uh, county three twenty two. How do you show me now? Uh, I've got you in cat now. Oh, two four. Were you in another world? Uh, no, I don't, it must have been a glitch. That far. Yeah, no, I, I was, but then I switched. I don't know if that, uh, affects it. Not sure. Because I switched to, uh, dare I say the Q word? It don't matter to me. It's up to you. It has been pretty slow. Four, four, five, ten. Slow. Yeah, you can show me 10, 30, 7, 10, 8. Ten thirty seven, ten eight, twenty thirty eight. Good evening. We won't use the Q or we'll use the S word. Oh, Soldier Field. Who is that? Who does that belong to? God, why does that sound familiar? I cannot for the life of me remember who that belongs to, though. This is Bugs' song, or no, no, is this? Listen, yeah, I think this is Bugs' song, or maybe this is Ryan. It's either it's either Bugs or Ryan. I can't remember. Maybe y'all can help me out, chat. Whose song is this? Hey, 
that Bugs? I think it's Bugs' song. Damn, 1924? That's crazy. Used to be Bugs', right? Okay, yeah, that's what I thought. That's what I thought, okay. And then he changed it. Then he changed it to, I think, the cartoon theme, or the cartoon song now. Yeah, this used to be his old theme song. It's a bop. I'm not gonna lie, it's a pretty good jam. Ark by Star Party and the Zookeepers. Not a whole lot popping off right now, I will say that. Uh oh, Ella's in server. I guarantee she's gonna be state. She's gonna be, uh. She's gonna be San Andreas Highway Patrol. Chicago Bears? Really? I'm not too big on football. I will say that. Like, I'm not too big on the NFL. I know. It sounds really crazy of me. You know what I'm saying? Because, like, everybody fucking knows NFL. But I'm not really big on NFL. More um, basketball and baseball. How often do we do city? It, honestly, it just depends. Um... Usually, like on Fridays and Saturdays, is whenever the city gets popping, we'll have we'll have two different two different jurisdictions. So we'll have county, and then we'll have city, and then of course we'll have our state high our uh, San Andreas High Patrol. Um, so I mean, it just kind of depends. You ain't lying on that. You are lying on that. The original Yankee Stadium was cool. That's one thing I didn't get to visit whenever I was in New York. I wanted to, but, uh, you know, it is what it is. There was so much, there's only so much you could do in like freaking five days in New York. I'll tell you what, though, I got to see the Phantom of the Opera on Broadway like probably eight months before they took it off of Broadway. That was something to see. That was honestly the... I cried. I ain't gonna lie. I cried. It was so fucking beautiful. I've always wanted to see the Phantom of the Opera on Broadway. Nice to watch the Absolute Chaos from... Yo, so, um... Dude, so Bugs's Bugs's video, um... Bugs' video of the investigation um, was freaking phenomenal. Um, it was so funny because I didn't even realize that he's like, the whole time he's like, I wish that cop that pulled me over would come and like talk to me and ask me about the freaking shirts. That wasn't even like, that wasn't even planned. It was the fact is, is that he sent me over to the maze bank saying that they had the shirts. And so I went to go look and then whenever they didn't have them, I was upset. So I was like, all right, I'm going to go talk to this guy. <laughs> like, I got to go. I got to go figure out what the hell it was. Because at first he told me it was like buy a small soda and you get a free shirt. Then he's like, oh, yeah, no, it was buy a fedora and get a free shirt. Or, or come with a fedora and get a free shirt. Mm -hmm. Okay. Then he said you can get uh, like free shorts. And I was like, are you serious? Like, I just I need to go buy a fedora. If I could, I'd wear a fedora on my cop character. <laughs> if I was to see Bugs tonight, and I'm just wearing a fedora, could you imagine? That'd be freaking hilarious. Get the fuck out. They actually de they de they demolished it? What? Bugs is a master. He really is. Dude, I freaking... I've been watching Bugs since, uh, like, I don't know, probably like six, maybe seven years now. Maybe like eight years now, to be honest. Um, I've been watching Bugs. I actually found, uh, I found Bugs first, and then through Bugs, I found Jeff. 
and then also through bugs i found ryan and ryan is a freaking riot dude i remember ryan whenever he was only on twitch and he would always run the 24 7 that shit was freaking fun that was probably the the fun times everybody would donate like 247 two dollars and 47 cents to him freaking hilarious it was like an ongoing joke Expect me to <laughs> Dude, could you imagine cop just shows up in a suburban shirt? <laughs> Looks like uh, we got some LEO coming in. We got a decent amount of LEO. Um, so I'm going to go ahead and switch. Oh, we know who this guy is. Johnny 322. I'm gonna be out on a traffic stop at the intersection of Panorama and Joshua 1025. Stand by for catalog. Whoa, I totally spelled that wrong. Traffic stop, ran a red light. L P H O R space space D E R. Occupied times one. I'm just gonna walk up to the side. Metro I don't zero three nine. Should we doing a property check at six nine seven? Street. Hey, how's it going, sir? Deputy Rap. catch up with the LB, Blaine County uh, Sheriff's Portola. Office. Uh, the reason for the uh -huh. stop is that you ran through that red light right there. Oh, I, the, 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 the truck probably ran through it. I, I, I thought I'd go with him. Wait, what? The, the, the truck in front of me it ran through it. I thought I could follow him through. You know, one of those like no well, stop, no shows. Mm -hmm. Yeah, you mean no cop, no stop? No, you, well, I mean there's a cop right here. I don't know why why it would be no cop, no shop. I don't. It, you know. So look, the reason for the stop is for the. Uh, oh my. Uh -huh. What is that? Um. What is that smell? Oh, it's a, it's, a, it's just scrapping. I mean, just probably a little bit of that, that, that scrap in the back, you know, marinates in the sun, gets cooking scrap? a little bit. It smells smells real good right about now. You want a taste of it? No, ew, no, no, no I'm good. Scrap? Mm-hmm. Okay. Um, all right, sir, do you have your driver's license and proof of insurance with you? Yeah, I sure do. It's right here. It's Gary Barnhart. You know, you know, you know how to spell barn heart. It's right on there. You know, it's got no D at the end. It's just a barn and then heart with an A R T. I okay. like to spell it myself. Okay, Mister Barnhart, just um, hey, sit tight with me real quick, okay? Um, mm -hmm. oh my God, you really need to clean this truck out. All right, uh, just sit it, tight with me for a second. It's valuable. All the stuff in here is valuable. Don't tell me I ain't cleaning it out. It's oh, valuable I'll clean stuff. Out your car. There's a mm -hmm. burger wrapper from the Up and Atom just sitting Sale there. Sell it sell it you can sell you can sell a wrapper mm -hmm. you can sell anything on the facebook marketplace i don't think anybody wants to buy a used burger wrapper but all right just uh i could sell you you could sell me no sir i'm not for sale mm -hmm. that's called dollars. that's called prostitution and that's not that's not legal prostitute no I, I ain't no prostitute that that that's that's that lady down the road over there that, that's a prostitute oh yeah that yeah all right, well, just sit tight with me, Mr. Barnhart, and I'll be right with you, okay? Mm-hmm. Oh, my God, it stinks in there. <laughs> Gary, right? He said his first name was Gary. Gary Barnhart. 68. Occupation is construction. License is going to be approved. Vehicle registration is approved and valid. Let's see what is a. Uh... Okay. 
Okay, so he's got a little bit of reckless failure. To, okay, all right. So general citations. Let's see what he's got here. Trespassing, reckless driving. Okay, all right. Let's see what his arrests are. Aggravated like assault, trespass on property other than destruction, and trafficking of stolen and dealing and stuff. Oh, okay. All right, Mr. Barnhart. This, mm -hmm. oh, my, oh, my God. Yep. Mm -hmm. Soak it in. It smells delicious. Jesus. This is... Yep. It, this smells so rank. Mm -hmm. Okay. Excuse... Rank? Yes. It smells disgusting. Uh, oh, my God. Mm. Just like your mom. 322 County South Track. Uh, I'm going to be 10-4 at this time. 10 4 what, what, you go okay be going to your mom's later I'm, I'm gonna be there anyway no, so. hey, you you leave my mother out of this well i i, I, I believe it or not i mean she, she she called me that's all i'm saying you know and okay I'm, I'm all right there. sir that, that's mm -hmm. enough of that okay uh, what well, me going over your mom's house i mean there's gonna be plenty of it later mr barnhart mm -hmm. let's leave my mother out of this all right she's the saint she must be a saint she called me after all Oh my! Here's your driver's license back, sir. Yep. Mm-hmm. All right. Please get this hunk of junk, full of junk, yep. back to wherever you took it. Mm-hmm. Please get well, rid of some Mavi, of this trash. Did you just call the Barnard Bronco hunk of junk? Yes, I did. It's got junk all over the damn place. You got freaking burger wrappers everywhere. It's, it's, it's disgusting. You know it's what? Bombs. I will pay you for a detail to go get this thing detailed. It is so disgusting. My I'll nose hairs leave are your singed. Mom's house alone for 20 minutes. How about that? What? You have a good day, officer. Yeah, all right. Get out of here. Mm-hmm. See your mom. Okay. <laughs> oh, my God. <laughs> County 322. I'm going to be back 10-8 with the uh, verbal warning. 322-988 with a verbal warning, 2052. Actually, go ahead and, uh, I should try, I should actually show myself, 10-7. Uh, County 322, actually, you can go ahead and show me, uh, 10 7 10 for the night. Uh, 2052. Have a nice night. Thanks for your service. There we go. That was a fun interaction. I like I like stuff like that. As a cop, that's the fun stuff to have. All right, I gotta get a car for this old man. Help me pick a car for Arthur Bennett. It's my, it's my old man character, scene, and he um, talks like an old man. Refer to call notes for any more information. What up, Mars? Gotcha, Welcome back. Channel switched. What kind of uh what kind of car would this old man drive? It's gonna be a sedan of some sort. Ooh. Ooh. Kinda digging it? Kinda digging it. What do you think? The old Roosevelt? Ooh. All right, before I forget, let me uh, do my loadouts. Or actually, we'll do remove all weapons, player options, and then set to no armor. Last time I got out of LEO, um, I forgot to take that off. 80s. 80 Silverado? Okay, maybe. The old Roosevelt. What's the Roosevelt Thunder? That's a good question. I feel like this guy is definitely not a, uh... Oh, no. 
That's um that's what's his name's Is it under sedans? Okay. I feel like this would be actually fit them pretty well, like a town car. Let's see if it's under regular sedans. Roosevelt. No, it's not even under here either. Compact? Yeah, the town car for sure. I'm thinking this one. Let me set the speed limiter on it. Set this as my personal vehicle. Vehicle options. Speed limiter. There we go. All right. Let's go Civ. Arthur Bennett, DMV vehicle registration. We'll do approved and valid expiration due April 23rd of 2025. Vehicle type is a sedan. License plate is PLZ. Was it? Oh my goodness. Seven seven nine. PLZ seven seven nine. It's a Lincoln town car. Black in color. I don't even know if I have a license. Let me just approve, valid, driver's license expires 19th. 75 years old. All right. It's time to do the. Uh, Yes, I like it. <laughs> I'm gonna have so much fun with this guy. Oh my god, I was here. I was here. I was talking about the old days. Yes, I'm gonna have so much fun with this. Tired, so might not stay long after 10 months. No doubt, Moon. It's the fact that you stopped by and said what's up. That's what matters. So I'm registered and everything is legal. So they can't tell me nothing. There is so many sims in server right now. Oh my gosh. I gotta do the There we go. Gotta do the laster walk. How is everything? It's all good, man. My site traffic is up. Una tonelada Can I clear the area? Unique users. There we go. Perfect. Perfect.
All right. Time to do it. <laughs> Let's go, bro. I am so... Alright, so next time we'll just do free pull and darts. Alright, I'll be right back, chat. Give me one second. I'm gonna go grab a beer because this should be an interesting night. Doors are now locked. All right, cool. All right. Uh, emo. Oops. Emotes. Bar. There we go. We just do bartender. I like that. That's cool. Let's go, dude. I am so excited to, to freaking open up the Yellow Jack again. You know how long it's been since the Yellow Jack <laughs> made the registration 92 and license in 93? Oh my god, could you imagine? Start start talking about the old times? I'm down. We're gonna be here for a while. This is um so just kinda sit back and relax and get ready, cause this is gonna be a long night of some chill rp it's gonna be chill it's gonna be some chill rp it's not gonna be too crazy um like i said i think i want to try and do this kind of chill tonight and see what happens i don't even remember the last time someone ran it it's been that's what i'm saying it's been so long it's been so long since somebody ran the yellow jack so we're just gonna The hell is this? Sixteen nine dollars. Oh my god! Hey, that's the chick from Grand Theft Auto San Andreas, right? That's the chick from San Andreas, I think. That's so crazy. On the dollar bill in the in the in the top right, isn't that the chick from San Andreas? So whenever people get here. Wow. Okay. All right, Mars. Bam. You're gone. <laughs> ah, the good old days. Weren't those the good days? I have my star fairy lights on and now my... And my low LED lights, and it looks awesome. Dude, hell yeah. So I went to the vape store and bought it. Oh, my face cam is off. Sorry. I went to the vape store and bought a new vape. It's a Geek Bar Pulse. Apparently, it's the new Geek Bars, apparently. 
it said it was uh it has like ten thousand hits on it but the battery is dying pretty damn quick i've been i've only been puffing on it a couple times it's already at 92 percent it is rechargeable so i don't know maybe we'll get a fresh charge on it today love to just have my room a whole ass vibe hey moon you never said what kind of music you listen to Oh, I think I hear somebody. We might have our first customer. Meta Moon? Interesting. I don't think I've heard of that one yet. This one is um Black Cherry. Yeah, Black Cherry. Tastes pretty good, I'm not gonna lie. The guy, I was sitting there and I was kind of like, I was, I was doing like a sample of them. But the guy came up with this one. He's like, dude, this one's my personal favorite. He's like, but some people say it tastes like licorice. So I tried it, and it tasted good. I was like, yo, like, that's the one. Oh, God. Oh, my God. You're an old fuck. Oh, hey, how's it going there, sonny? You're how so can I help old. you today? Oh, my God. Do you know how to park, sir? Uh, that's my parking spot. That's the front entry. Oh, God, my hands been going downhill. Mm -hmm. Hey, I'm the new manager here. What are you yeah, talking about? Yeah, I used to own this place. It's really going to the shitter. Oh, man, man, excuse me. Hey, that new manager sucks. Excuse me, I am the new manager. Yeah, that new manager around here, he sucks. Can I get you something? Anything that's not alcoholic. Sir, this is a bar. We have I, a I, I, don't drink. I, I, I agree with him. I actually don't drink either. I can get you like a loaf soda or something. Do you have chocolate milk? They used to serve chocolate milk here. I no, want my chocolate, milk. chocolate milk. Chocolate milk, please. Chocolate milk, bitch. I don't have chocolate milk. I want my chocolate milk or I'm dumping a part of scrap on your hood. Hey, you can't do that. Bullshit, I can't. He will. He's a maniac. And also I'm a sell. maniac. He's also a prostitute. I'm a prostitute. Can I... Can I oh. <laughs> Can I offer you a, uh... Chocolate milk? Yes. A, a club mm -hmm. soda? Club? I, it ain't no club. My only club, I got some back trunk, and that's to beat people up. That's not good. Please don't beat me up. I ain't gonna beat you up. I'm gonna go to your mom's lair and take care of business. You know what I mean? Hoo-hoo. No, sir. My mom's been dead for at least 30 years. Well, he's got old. that shovel. Yeah. What? That's a crime. You could call the police for that. He just admitted to... Many Ray Robin, ding. Okay, so you want? What do you want? You want a chocolate I want milk? To work. I want to play some I tunes and regular pump milk. It. He wants to listen to tunes and pump it to chocolate milk. Okay, I got regular milk. No, no, no. Got better get that syrup out, or I'm gonna start throwing shit. All right, hold on. Let me see what I can whip up over here. Better not be whipping anything out. Except chocolate milk. Except chocolate milk, of course. It looks so much different. Yeah, it's like like there's so much more detail to you. Like your. Yeah. It, 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 I wonder. If, I wonder if these new glasses are doing anything. It just. It oh, just do you have? Oh, those new glasses. Yes, I have new glasses. Yes. I mm -hmm. really appreciate my style. God, I'm fat. Pours milk in the glass, puts coffee grounds in the milk, and starts stirring to turn into a okay, chocolate milk. Okay, what drink. kind of syrup are you using? That looks, that looks kind of chunky. Here you go, sir. Here's one chocolate oh. milk. Well, thank you. I just am. Uh, what? What? What in the goddamn is this? It's chocolate milk. Oh my god. It's no, chocolate that shit. Are you trying to poison him? <laughs> Good, at least, but like, do better, Joe. What the hell's your deal, buddy? You want to take the hat off and throw you around outside like a sack of shit? I don't have a hat. Not you. He's talking no, to me. No, I'm talking yeah, to the fat guy on the you, counter. You old bastard. Okay, sir, that's very aggressive. 
You're aggressive. You try to poison me. They also wearing your reindeer sweater, <laughs> your Christmas sweater. It's, 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 it's April. Get the Who hell the fuck wears yourself. a sweater? That, 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 that shit's stupid hey, shit. I wear sweaters. It's cold. It's not Christmas anymore. It's cold outside. We're no, living in a goddamn not. desert. What do you mean it's cold? I'm going to look at the weather right now on my phone. I'm old and I'm fragile. I'm it's cold. Gary, look at your phone. Look at the weather. You tell me the temperature right now because it's telling me that it's... Wait, let, let, let's look here. Let, let, let's pull up the weather app. It's it says right it's... here. Mm-hmm. 95? Where the fuck are you getting a sweater from? That thing's melting off it's your ass. It's cold in here. What, air conditioning we here hasn't worked in years. Well, we fixed it. And the new management. Well, we fixed the new it. management sucks fixing stuff. Well, well, I can offer you a free game of pool if you it's would like. It's already free. It was on and the advertisement. And that was already free darts. Free. You said that was also free still. I, I am not gonna play farts with you, sir. No, not farts. Darts. That's a bad way to go down Chocolate River. That's all I'm gonna say. Well, you want to chop the milk? I did the best that I could. Why the hell you selling cigarettes in here? What the hell is this shit? You selling cigarettes? They don't do the cigarettes. Oh, yeah, that's how we make our side muscle. Why would you ever sell cigarettes? Hang on, no. He said, did you say sad muscle? No, I said side muscle. No, you definitely did not. I did say side muscle. Are you going to pull out your muscle? I got muscles. No, no, sir. No. I kick your ass. I oh, have you know I can lift a two pound weight with these. And I can lift your ass into a dumpster. Is that a threat? That's a promise. You know what, sir? We don't want your business here. Well, he's I don't want well. your company. Well, why'd you come here then? Well, shit, I guess I'm gonna go clog the toilet and get the hell out. No, don't you dare. No, that oh, man, watch man, me. You better watch that it. Toilets for paying customers. That toilets for paying customers. Oh, Here it come. <laughs> oh boy. I'm heading oh, in the no. bathroom. Sir, feel free to play anything on the jukebox you want. Okay. We got Conway Twitty nope. and Conway Twitty. What about oh no YMCA? No, no, we don't do YMCA. New management sucks. Oh, he's he's really back there destroying the bathroom. He's over there punishing our toilet. Yeah, and he didn't even pay for it. I don't even think he wiped. Probably not. That song bitch ain't gonna get used two months now. <laughs> took the lid off it. <laughs> what? What did he say? He took the lid off it. I think he vandalized your toilet. Oh my God, he's in there punishing our toilet. He didn't even oh, he pay left. for that. He didn't even pay for Oh, now he's spraying your business. Gary, you can't use the hose. What do you mean I can't use the hose? Oh, that's not your hose to use. Sir, you're. Sir, please, 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 please stay up. No point. Clap your arms. Good, that shows you how much of a bitch you are in a scale from zero to ten. You're a ten time bitch. Whoa, okay, sir. Okay. You're. Gary. You're. Your business is no longer welcome here oh, he's at the Yellow Jack. Get in. Are you banning me from the Yellow Jack? I'm banning you from the Yellow Jack. I'll I know, remember place you your can't... face, I think. Uh, I'll tell you what, there's one place you can't ban me from, the Little Santos Cemetery. I'll be there shortly. Apparently he's going to go bang your dead mom. Whoa. Yeah. And you'll probably be dead soon, too, so... Dog. What are you even, are you trying to tell me I'm old person? Yes. I feel like I'm at least 72. What are you talking about? Are you like 90? He's going to hit your car, by the way. I'm 75 years old. Oh, Gary, you got to go straight. Hang on, I'll help you get out of here. Go straight. You gotta, you gotta go yeah, straight. just turn left. Turn left. All right, reverse. Reverse. Yeah, you're good. Hey, reverse. don't you hit my car. Hey. Yeah, now you're good. You're good. Just turn out now. Oh, I got to turn around that. Let me know. Yeah. I need your insurance. Oh, you need my insurance? Hold on, let me get out real quick. You just hit my car. This is a classic. It's... it's... Oh. Oh, my goodness. So 
Oh my god, you scored a breeze. You use flat tires. I swear to god, do I have flat tires? Son of a bitch. Okay, now if you want to call the police on them. Oh god. Oh my goodness. I swear I only gave them chocolate milk. Oh, well, here comes the police officer for you. Hey, hey, officer! All right, all right, all right. Who hey, was a petty, dickless cocksucker? He hey, hit, oh what? he hit my car! He's... Uh, he, he I want to press charge. Some the asshole cut my tires and caused an accident. Guten Tag. Guten Tag, I want to fucking press charges. I'm pressing okay. charges on you! We you destroyed my time. toilet! So he, he hired somebody to come out here and cut my jack. tires. He knew what um, I was doing. You destroyed my here. toilet and you didn't even pay One for it! Individual you want me to pay for, for it? I want you to pay for it! <laughs> oh, <laughs> That's what so I think about that! Oh, Assault! Huh, what's the problem with bourbon? Assault! Oh my god. Yep. Right. So who hit whose vehicle? Why is your well, vehicle? Well, he, cu he, he cut my tire. That's what he did. I, he did I it. was Number inside one. the whole time. I saw well, you, you the rat from inside. like absolutely pull out here crazily. Because I had three flat time. tires and I blew them all and lost control. See? He blew them himself. Go over there and look at my tires. Prick. And they he also blew up the toilet. Me? I, I'm not old prick. I I, I, I got a brown heart bronco so, right over there. Are you involved apart from I'm, just uh, being a witness? I'm the lead detective on the case. Yeah, yeah, you are. Lead um, detective on okay. the case. Okay, sir, if I can get you to stand over there. See you, Gary. Oh, yeah. Stand over there. NCIS. Stand over there. All right. By the light. Green on that one. That's not English. Oh my god, he's being sneaky. <laughs> no, you're gonna go much your router? What? Oh, you punched it. <laughs> hey, sir. Hey, how's it going, uh, what man? What exactly, uh, what happened here? So... This, this maniac over here, he came into my bar, and he wanted a chocolate milk. So, I gave him a chocolate milk, and then he said it was disgusting. So then he went and he, 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 he said he was gonna blow up my toilet, and, and he blew up my toilet. He blew up your toilet? Yeah, he blew poop, my poop. toilet up. Poop, poop, yeah. Oh, that's, that's kind of impressive. So, okay. And then, and then he walked outside and he was trying to leave and well, he sorry, backed into we're, my we're, Lincoln we're getting, over there. Yeah, so how did his vehicle end up over there and how did yours, what happened to yours? I don't know, he sure. took off, to he sounded like he had some it's flat tires. So yeah, whenever he took off, stash. I guess he lost control sure. and then he hit the ball. Is Riley working? Is he drunk? Hey. Uh, hey, zero three nine. No, you should not yeah, be here. Uh, could you go and speak to Gary oh, over there for me? Gary, yeah, I'll brief you on yeah, that apparently guy. he, yeah, that guy stood up with Lee dancing over there. Yeah, let me brief you. But be careful, he might talk about your mother. Oh, so Gary's a traditional offender. You know? Oh yeah, he said he's meeting with my mother. My mother's been dead for thirty years. Yeah, that's unfortunately something he does. Um. He just loves mothers. He's a real jerk, that guy. Yeah, he's, he's something. I'm definitely gonna um get him for reckless because I did see the way he pulled out of here and then turned around and went straight into that post over there. Yeah, he backed directly into my car. Um, do you have any um? I think it the uh, Mr. Figel there is a witness. Yeah, he saw the whole thing. Okay. What's your name for the record? My name's Arthur Bennett. That's two N's and two T's. 
Oh, I can't believe this. We just opened this place back up and this is it. This is how it happens. This is the first night. Um, I'm sorry this has happened, sir. Um, can you quickly just spell your last name for me? Yeah, it's Arthur yeah, Bennett. To them. It it's B-E-N-N-E-T-T. -T. It's a real crime Gary did. Okay, thank you. Uh... What Mr. Fidel, you did, he did you see him? Hit? I, saw, I saw everything. You saw the toilet incident as well. I well, no, I didn't go into the bathroom. I saw him go into the bathroom. I didn't see him in the bathroom. Now yeah, you can't do that. That's against the law to be watching people pooping. You can't be doing that. Oh my God, she died. I don't know what it is with these yeah, kids Yeah, yeah, you're today. correct. You're correct with this that. This would have um, never happened back in my day. You definitely saw him like hit uh, Mr. Bennett's World character. World War One. What? I'm not that old. Civil War? Wow. Wow, well, that's theory? insulting, sir. If you guys stay here, I'm going to speak to my other fellows here. Don't worry, I got him. Where were you the night of the 23rd? Uh, I don't remember. Okay, you son of a bitch. We know you did it. I Where's didn't the do body? Anything. Where's the body? I didn't do it. Okay. You know what? You want to play hardball? Where's the body? Whoa! Hey, whoa! Uh, take it easy. Where's the body? I didn't do it. I don't know what body you're talking about. July 19th, 1973. Um. 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 I don't remember. You son of a bitch. <laughs> Book him. Just admitted to murder. What's wrong with the youth these days? Xbox. All of y'all got all these newfangled uh, yellow phones. Back phone, in yeah. my day, we could pick up the phone and dial information, and they tell you anything you need to know. Okay, I'll call. I can call that too and get all the information you know. Back in my day, there was only four people who had a telephone. Oh God, you're really old. You're so old. You're like super old. It looks at Mr. Bennett's car. Do I see any evidence that Gary backed into it? I'll wait to see what somebody else says. We'll see if anybody says anything, but if nobody says anything in like the next minute, then we'll we'll put it in there. <laughs> I'm sorry, Moon. I wish we could help you out. What a great first scene. I'm sorry you had to get caught up in this, Sonny. Oh no, I'm pleading the fifth. I ain't helping either of you. Well, you're not doing what now? I'm not helping either of you. I'm pleading the fifth. If anything, I'd been saying that both of you did it. I'm actually hoping they'll take both of you to jail. Why would they take me to jail? I did nothing. Nah, I've, mm, for my accounts, you did a bunch of crimes. What did I do? Everything. All Pumped I did was serve milk. You tried to poison them. What do you mean I didn't do? 
didn't stab his tires. I was oh, inside the whole time. Oh, see, now you know they were stabbed. Yeah. Over here? Yeah. Whatever he says, it's a lie. <laughs> Don't even feel like it. For real, it's been an hour? Damn. Okay, that's fine. Okay, that's fine. Hello. Welcome to the Yellow Jack. Thanks. My name's Arthur Bennett. I'll be your bartender. I'm not in the bar yet. Oh, okay. Well, the first round of beer is free tonight for the grand opening. I'll look you up when I come in. All righty. Hey, this this old bitch is really ruining the yellow jack. He doesn't serve chocolate milk no more. He, Who are you calling old, Sonny? Sir, I'm calling you old. Oh, uh, yeah, well, I can and say he, something about then, that gun. Yeah, but then Gary tried to sell his body to him, and it's a whole, it's a whole thing. <laughs> now the city's cops are here dealing with it, and I'm very confused. Great. So confusing. <clears throat> yeah, well, I'm lead detective. I'm lead detective. Uh, well, I'm just, I, I don't, I'm, but then the cops are asking me to tell them what happened. Do y'all think warheads are sour? Yeah, they're sour for like a little bit, but not too much. Why is he dancing like that? And why is there a cop just sitting there? The drunk stream? You never know, you might see it eventually. a lot for me to get drunk well not not really anymore i actually cut down on my drinking All right, um, are you wanting to press any charges? Press charges, press charges for what? For him hitting your vehicle or anything. Um, if not, yeah. it's just going to be a simple uh, in insurance. I think even with you pressing charges, if he decides to press charges against you, um, ask. Charges against me for what? He, be he believes that you slashed his tires. Now we can't prove anything. I was inside anything. the whole time. But um, well, the thing is, there's two I'm cameras the here, so we can't really. Here. Yeah, that's fine. But I, like, we have there's, there's no cameras. Uh, nobody to prove anything. 
Um, so it, it may just end up being a simple insurance swap. If he wants to press charges, I'm pressing charges on him! Okay, and then we're going to say that. If not, like, other than that, it's probably just going to be an insurance swap, okay? Alrighty then, my insurance is in the car! Okay, I'll grab that if needed. Toxic waste, toxic waste candy you have is more sour. What is that? He said he's pressing charges. Well, I'm gonna press charges on him. Gary, he's pressing charges. He's pressing, he's pressing, he's pressing, he's pressing charges. He's not pressing charges, sir. I'm not pressing charges on him. He's pressing charges on me. Are you pressing charges on me? He's not yeah. pressing charges. It's, it's, it's up to you, buddy. No. You want to press charges on me? I'll oh, press them on you. Well, if you're not gonna did. press charges, I don't want to press charges. Gary, he said he's gonna do it when you're not looking. He's not going to press charges. I just want we just uh, want it, your insurance, and we'll pass it over to. That's what we just want a simple insurance. If he doesn't press want. charges, I will press charges. Perfect. I'll tell Once you one thing right now, buddy. Press charges. If if you press charges, that well. shit's running downhill. What? You already well, shit in my toilet, too. and I'll do it again, <laughs> double decker. Oh my goodness, what's the it matter take with you, these kids take you a decade days. to clean out that puppy. I tell you what, she's gonna scream. Jesus, dude. <laughs> Is the bathroom a crime scene? It might be. I, I yeah, didn't want so to go in there. You need to go photograph that. Like, using the restroom is not a crime. Oh, I think what he did in there was a crime. Oh, I'm sure it can qualify in some countries that as a crime, need, but he it was definitely punishing my yeah. toilet. So you need to document it. You can't punish an inanimate object. All right. Oh, I understand you can punish pallets just fine, and there will be justice if they are punished. What, what, what does pallets have to do with me? Those pallets are real objects. Hey, buddy, I, we got the insurance for you. Okay, thanks. Okay. I'll take it. Is your insurance still in the car? My insurance is in my glove box. <laughs> hey, let me. Uh... Oh, oh, oh. Oh, sorry about that. I just wanted to you know to pass that in for me. Uh, what? 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 That's just rude. No, I need to burp in his face. Well, he likes it. It's disgusting. You're just, disgusting. Mr. Reddick, just go and grab your insurance for me, okay? Yeah, the door is unlocked. Can you go grab it? Yeah, I can do that. I'll grab it. Gary, no, no Gary. You get away Gary. from my car. Gary. Well, oh, 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 do assuming not. I'm going to steal it. I get it. Yep. Here you go, young lady. I appreciate it. Thank you. No problem. Oh, I probably shit. shouldn't have said that. That doesn't mean you just take it. Yeah, I, I just meant that there's scrap. Well, right, Don't go into his car. This is, this is a beneficial stuff he right here. He does this. You're going to have to kill him. He's going to be your trash, at least. I just want to say, I hear that petite bullshit. I ain't no petite son bitch. He's, he's very mad he got petite yeah. deft once for that? stealing yeah, garbage. Who's petite? You're not petite. Mr. Bennett's uh, insurance is fired in 1982. In 1982? You're not. How? What? 1982, sir? I'm sorry, speaking to my hearing aid. I have over here. Your insurance expired in 1982, you old bitch. Oh, yeah. Yeah, it's, it's, it's old. It's an old car. Out of the trees, you know, out of the brush, 
I let me. Don't worry about it. I ain't gonna run anywhere. I ain't gonna do anything dirty. I ain't gonna be a bad boy. I ain't gonna do anything wrong. I'm all good. I'm everywhere which way you want to be. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Oh, oh God. <laughs> you do that again, I am gonna press charges. You That's do that assault. again, I am gonna shit in your toilet a second time. That's assault. All right, gentlemen, this is, this is separate. Okay? Yeah, no, that's not assault. That's a pleasure. You want some of that too, big guy? Yeah, I, think I might be I'll old, but I can still again. kick you're your ass. ass. Yeah, you don't think I'll do it again? No, I don't think you'll do it to him again. Really? Yeah, I don't think you will. You better not. All right. All right. You better get away from me! Oh. Two for one. That's it. I won! Uh, Alright, I'm pressing over the charges! Whoa, why? What? Carrie! Four Jesus for one! Jerry. That's a song! Oh dear god, Gary. We're up in that one a little bit. Right, okay. What are, we, what are you pressing charges for? That's a salty burp in my face! That was an unwanted burp! I don't eat salt, dumbass. That that was that was pleasure. in your face, sir. I'm gonna... Um. Yeah. What up, cat yeah, nip in the building? What up? Petite this. Oh, let's you shut up about your petite nip. There ain't nothing petite about you, Buzz. Little sonny. Excuse me. He just verbally assaulted me. I need to press charges. I'm doing nothing but just sitting here. Yeah, they're in the reason for that, those words, sir. I want him arrested. He assaulted me with bodily fluids. I didn't give any body fluids to you. If you want you to, I can. You in my face whenever you burped. I burped in your face. There was nothing but food follicles and that shit. Yeah, that's a you Guys, soul. hey, look. Do I have what, to really you have to separate some? you? You please, really? Please, do I have to separate please. you from the besides the hard drive? All I'm gonna do is burp and say a shit in the hard drive. Fight, 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 fight. Oh, somebody be on. Oh, what? No threats, all right? Oh, you want to go six clicks down shit creek with your mouth wide open, buddy? Come on now, let's do. It. <laughs> well, nothing. Good. Stay separate. Stay quiet. Fight. That's right, Hollywood. Sir, Mr. Frank Holes, or whatever your name is, is that what you got? Frank! Yes, you Frank. Oh, I know Frank. He died 20 Frank, years sir? ago. Way to make it sad. Yeah, it's a real awkward. What happened? Yeah, it was the press in his head. It's a crab. Who's your not, name? Not public? everything is a crime, guys. The only crime here is you with those suspenders and that big okay. cut. Sir, what in the actual hell? Sir, there really is no reason for all these comments we're having right now. At this point, that okay, could be considered. Okay, I would like to be a witness. Gary never hit his core. It's true. <laughs> Oh, the problem is you have a deputy who saw it, though. So. No, she did it. Yes, she did. No, she got here after she saw it. No, after I was sitting over it. there, but I saw it happen. Okay, you saw that, but you didn't see Gary spin out of here and run, go out of control and hit the tree? I did see that. Okay, That's why Jerry I came over. should be getting a ticket oh, for... Oh, sounds like Gary to jail, to Sonny! Gary! How are you doing Gary. a ticket, Gary? <laughs> sounds like Gary's going to jail! Going to, well, we got three deputies here now. For what? I've never been other than a bird. Because honestly, yeah, he might have an answer for me. That's okay. assault. You burped in my face. Look, you're both going to be charged with harassment if you both don't stop, all right? I ain't going to harass anybody. Business, you're both going to harass everyone. I already going to Jurassic Park. I want him bullshit. banned from sir, the property. You know, sir, this, okay, step back for a second. Can you get banned from life? Let me make sure before I did anything. 
curved on that 30 time. Right, I, okay. Mr. Bennett. Yes? You cannot press charges for someone burping in your face. It's not- That's an assault! It's, what is that shit it's not- What's your guy? Well, I oh, want him banned! I don't want to see him back You want him? That's fine. We can- we can trespass him. I, you're out him. of here, buddy! Don't know. Um, I'm yeah. out of here? I didn't want to be here anyway. Well then why'd you come? Because I wanted to see your stupid ass try and serve me a chocolate milk. Gentlemen. We don't do chocolate milk here. Well, I thought you did and you didn't. Now you disappointed me. Now you lost the customer. Guess what? Nuclear bomb. What? Is, is that a threat? Have fun cleaning that toilet there, buddy. It's going to take years to wash that out. That porcelain pony's screaming for mercy. Even if it, like, when does it go into effect? Is he even trespass? He's going back in there. I'm going to trespass him. <laughs> Are you a city cow? Yeah, it's, yeah. it's a... It's a... Oh no, he's going to the toilet! Hey, get out of there! You get into my toilet! Yeah, hey, hey, get hey, out oh, of my door's bathroom. locked! I'm shaking the walls down! You get out of there! Get out of my toilet! Hey, hey, come here! Oh my in. God! Come here! Come here! I come here! Oh my come, come here! Come here! Hey, if you if say I hate your sandals and don't run out of there, say it really loud. Why yeah. Are you hey, I hate there? your sandals. Get out of here! You son of a bitch! Oh! Hey! 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 Gary. Oh my god. Hi, hello. Why? They insulted me! Over the old man. Hey, yeah, well, you Mr. Bennett, can you step well, back, I'm please? Sorry, Deputy. They insulted me! I got you. What's Punch happened? Watch your bet. Punch hey, how's it going, sir? Can I interest Punch you that in man a free in the beer? What? No, I'm good. I'm just here for the fight. I heard you were fighting. You were going to kick that guy's hand. No, he burped in my face. Well, and yeah, you should definitely me. punch him in the mouth. He's in oh. close. This will be easier time now. Yeah, he can't even fight back. Should I? No, I, I got oh, a just business to run. Just, oh, it's fine. We'll run it until you get back. Can I interest you in a chocolate milk? No, don't. It's garbage. No. <laughs> yeah, you're going to jail now, buddy. Yeah, I'm going to chop your head off and throw it down a bar. Hey. Belly. Oh, that's hey. a threat. It's a threat! Yeah, damn right it is. I advise you to zip it. You could really just go... You, know, you could just go slap it. Like free game. Well, we should probably get out of here, Brian. We we'll probably should before I get yeah. involved, because I definitely caused all of that. Thank you for choosing Lalo Jack. Y'all come back Thank now, you hear? <laughs> Yeah, I'll yeah, see you at your funeral, Get out of here! Yeah, I hope you fall off a building. Yeah, I hope you fall into yeah. a pool. Why is he coming off? Arms off Mr. Bennett. Hey, hey buddy, what, what, can you let us deal with this? Start ordering that gray I want that hunk of junk off my world. property. We will get it. We will get it towed. No. <laughs> oh my gosh. What's your name again, sir? My name is Arthur Bennett. 
Okay, Arthur, if you if you um, interfere in this investigation again, if you come over here and try to incite something, if you say anything again, you'll be charged with harassment and. I, I yes. want that hunk of junk off my property. It's going to be taken off. But I need you to stop interfering, okay? Okay. Thank you. <laughs> oh my goodness that was a good scene Sunglasses inside. Okay. So he's been arrested. He's been taken to jail. We've uh, towed his vehicle. I appreciate that. Thank you. That's don't worry about it. He's been trespassed from this property as well. So. Uh, what happens if he comes back? If he comes back, uh, phone us, uh, and we will come down and take him off property again. Okay. Okay. I hope the uh, rest of your day goes well. Thank you. Have a great day. Hey, if you want a yeah. free beer after shift, you come see me. I got you. Uh, okay, I'll keep that in mind. <laughs> oh my goodness. That was great. All right, let me... uh. Clear the area, that should reset the stools. Yeah, there we go. There we go. And... Oh, actually, I could... Can I sit on this? I think I could sit on this. I'm literally on top of the seat. What the fuck? Okay, guess I can't sit there.
right, chat, give me one sec. I'll be right back. I'm going to use the restroom real quick, and then I'll be right back. All right. Oh, we got twenty nine sieves. Hey, how's it going? Welcome Hello. to the yellow check. Hi, can I just get a beer? Yeah, no problem. What kind do you want? I don't know, man. Just whatever the cheapest one is. Okay, we got the the base washer and the logger. Which one's better? I prefer the base washer. Yeah, then I'll just have that one, man. Okay, do you want that in a bottle or on draft? Uh, draft. Okay, all right, give me one second. Here you go. Thanks, man. No problem, Sonny. What's your name? My name? Yeah, what's your name? My name's Colt. Colt, nice to meet you, Colt. My name is Arthur. I'm the new manager here. Oh, hi, Arthur. It's very nice to see the young generation coming out here and enjoying the Yellow Jack. By the way, we got free pool and free darts. Oh, sweet. Hang on, I'm gonna go play some pool. That's a nice change. Actually, a, a nice chill customer. <laughs> Um, uh, so Moon, I, man, I normally wouldn't be against that, but, uh, I'm kind of keeping it casual on this one. Uh, this is going to be, I think this is going to be like a new character where it's just kind of casual RP. 
I'm really digging the uh, the yellow jack here, just kind of chilling and enjoying um, enjoying customers coming. Of course, of course, we had to have fucking Matt or not Matt, um, uh, Killer. They had to have Killer come in, and of course Noah. They had to come wreck some shit. <laughs> But man, it's fun. It's all in all good fun. I, I I fucking loved it. That was a good scene. I had a really good time on that one. We might do some EMS a little bit later. It would be funny. It would be funny. That's also um like Drew does that a lot too. Have a good one. Yeah, you take care, sir. Thank you for coming. Y'all come back now. Dude, what the fuck is up with this shit? The fucking clear the area again. Re-wreck the table. I did not, but I saw your uh, your short or your your video that you posted. Did you get my Did you get my Discord message? That's a major one. If you didn't read your Discord message, you should read that. And I say that with like the utmost important because it can be, you know, used against you if you did. But also don't let people like that ruin your day either, so. Just walk away. Can I get a pipe? See what kind of happens tonight. Do we have toe on? We do, we do not have any toe. Okay. Oh, here comes somebody. Oh, look, an old person. Yes. Let's go. Let's go. Hey, how's it going? Oh, it's going pretty good. How about you? What? Huh? You got to speak up. I said it's going pretty good. How about you? Oh, it's going great. Thank you. What? I said it's going great. Oh, that's that's <laughs> good. That's good. 
Can I, I interest love... you in a beer? Yeah, yeah, do you got those non-alcoholic ones? What? No, this is a bar. Oh. What about uh, cola? Do you have cola? I do have cola. Do you want a cola? Uh, yeah, with, with some rum. With some rum? Okay, I could do that. All right. The first round is free and, how the, and the elderly drink for half price. Oh, awesome. All right, let me get that for you. All right. go it's a rum and coke awesome i appreciate it yeah no problem we also have the, the jukebox is free and so is the uh the pool oh really yeah it's it's a free free night we got the grand opening tonight i just oh. i'm the new manager of this place my name's arthur bennett Oh, nice to meet you, Arthur. My name's Seymour. Seymour Johnson. Nice to, nice to meet you. Seymour. Oh, that's a good name. Hey, yes. I like your car out there. Oh, thank you. Thank you. I remember back in my day, they only had three of those in this city. Yeah, a long, long time ago. Back before the Red Wedding. Yeah, I remember those days. Good times. Great times, great times. So what brings you around these parts? Oh, you know, just uh, you know, don't really have much to do now that I'm retired and everything. You know, I just kind of uh, mope around and see what's going on. Yeah, I tried to retire life myself, but it just wasn't for me. You know us old men, we like to work all the time. Exactly, exactly. I can I can only build so many birdhouses before I get tired of it. Oh, I, you telling me? I tried to build a rocking chair. It was a complete mess. Oh my goodness. I got tired of it, so I looked for a new job, and then I found this one. Well, I mean, it, you know, nothing, nothing wrong with serving some beers and making extra money. Yeah, you know, Social Security just doesn't cut it anymore. I know, you're telling me. I feel you like my lying, grandpappy man. was making so much more money on this stuff than I am. Oh, yeah. My grandpappy been gone for a while now. But I'll tell oh, you what, he used, he used to love the bar. My great-grandpappy, I mean... He used to he used to love moonshine. That was his beverage of choice. Oh, don't even get me started on the moonshine. I had a cousin of mine who used to run that stuff. Back whenever the prohibition was going on. Right, <laughs> right. Ah, uh, the good times. Good old days, good old days. So Seymour, what did you do before you were retired? Well, I did I did a little bit of everything. I, I was a carpenter for a long time, so I kind of, you know, I, I built houses. I, I also, you know, built sheds, um, garages. I did that too. Um, do you know how yeah. to build a rocking chair? A rocking chair? No. No, I don't, don't know how to do that. Oh, yeah, me neither. That's all I want to do is just sit on the front porch on the rocking chair and just enjoy the traffic and, and all the young people frolicking and having a good time. Hey, you're telling me? I mean, see, I was too lazy to, you know, build one, so I just bought one. I bought a, a nice little recliner, and it, it does, like, the vibrating stuff, too, for when you got a sore back. You know, it's got, like, a massaging back or something like that. I don't know. Oh, they, they got They swindled now? me into a big one, yeah. 
Oh, the future's great. I know, I know. I mean, still no flying cars, but uh, they're working on it, I'm sure. Oh, they'll get there eventually. I don't know if I'll be around to see it, but I sure hope I will. Yeah, yeah, same. It'd be, it'd be cool to see what they was talking about back when I was young. Did you see this new thing they got there? It's called, um, the, the birdie or something? Uh, I, I've uh, never really been much for the, the technological things. Yeah, me neither. My granddaughter was showing it to me. There's all kinds of crazy stuff on there. Like, like what? Oh, there's, you, you name it, you can find it. The internet is, is, it's like you can search for anything you want and you can figure out how to do it. Oh, that's, that's kind of nifty. Yeah, you can even hire carpenters from there. Oh, really? Well, it ain't like it used to be. No, I remember you used to have to go to the yellow pages. Yeah, or look in the, in the newspaper, in the, like, classified section and whatnot. Oh, the class That's where I found my car. That's, that's where I found my house. Oh, I bet you got a good deal on it. You probably paid, what, $25,000, uh, shoot, back in my day, yeah, it was probably like 33000 something like that. Oh, the good old day. These houses are so expensive now. I know, some some realtor fella, he came by my house, he's like, you could make millions. And I was like, but I don't want to make millions. I like my house right where it is. And he's like, but you can make millions and live in the island someplace. And I was like, I don't want to live in the islands. I like where I live. Now, all these young whippersnappers trying to make a quick buck. They don't know nothing about real work. I know, I know. I'm like, I understand my house is worth a lot of money, but, but I still live here. I'm, I don't plan on going anywhere. I it swear, could it's be like worse. you get old and they're trying to get rid of you. Yeah, my granddaughter tried to put me in a home. I told her that's not happening. I'd never go there. Those things, are, those things are crazy. It's like an insane asylum. I tell you, they tried to put me in diapers. Can you believe that? Really? I told them I can, I can use the facilities whenever I need to. It's, it's, it, it's, it's Boulder Dash. I can't believe they tried to put you in, in the diapers. I know my grandchildren. They're horrible. It's, it's crazy. They but, go around cussing all of the time. No respect. I remember back in my day, if, if you cussed, you were getting the switch. I know that's right. My, my pappy used to tell me to go out there and pick out a good one. And God forbid if you got a bad one. I know. It's <laughs> horrible. Or the belt. Oh my goodness. These kids just don't know nowadays. I know it, it's you can't do anything anymore. You 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 just look at them wrong, and it's it's all oh my goodness. The, the government's in your house, and they're they're trying to take everything from you. And uh. these kids nowadays so disrespect. Well, I had a young whippersnapper come in here. He asked for a chocolate milk. I said, "This is a bar. We don't sell chocolate milk." And then he went to my bathroom back there, and he destroyed it. I had to call a hazmat team. He destroyed your bathroom. Yeah, he pooped all in and it was bad. That's, that's repulsive. And then he hit my car and then he tried to hit me. Oh my goodness, elder abuse. It's all right. They arrested his ass. Hey, he got goodness. what was coming to him. He's damn whippersnappers, no respect. None! I told him I might be old, but I'll still whoop your ass! Exactly, exactly. Show him how it's really done. These kids nowadays, no respect. It's horrible! None. 
Got to hire security. Got Can you imagine? They technologies and everything like that. They, they don't even have the audacity to have genuine conversations. It's like you go to a restaurant or something and the, the kids are always buried in their phones. It's like, put the, put the darn thing down and enjoy your meal. Stop taking pictures of it and eat it. Damn. They always taking picture of their food. What's up with them? And it's not even like they made themselves. It's nothing to be. Yes. What are you? What are you proud of? Somebody else made you a meal and brought it to you. Like what? I remember back in my day, we used to make our bread from scratch. That was the real depression. <laughs> yeah. The hard tech. <laughs> And now, nowadays, all these kids, they want to be posting on the, 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 the TikTok. All they're doing is dancing. What's up with that? It's repulsive. I've seen some of those dance moves. It's, 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 it's very, disgusting. It's, it's ludicrous. It's very provocative. Exactly. Like, uh, they, they, they call it, like, twerking or something. I, it looks like you're having a seizure. I can't believe these kids. No respect for themselves. None. <laughs> How you doing on your drink there? Can I get you another one? Uh, I think I'll have a water. A water? Okay. Yeah, you know, you gotta have a little a little water, you know, help sober yourself up a little bit. Yes, sir, you got that right. One water coming up. Hey, did you want ice with that? Uh, yeah, I guess I'll have some ice. Here you go, sir. Thanks a bunch. Yeah, no problem. Hello there. Welcome to the Yellow Jack. How can I help you? Uh, hey, yeah. Can I just get a whiskey? Yeah, no problem. Here you are, there's one whiskey. Oh, thank you. No problem, it's on the house tonight. The first one's oh. free. Wow, okay. We also I have free pool and darts tonight. Oh. Oh, and the jukebox is free too, but it's only got Conway Twitty in there. That's a, that's a hell of a choice. Oh, yeah. Nothing but the classics. All right, yeah. Well, do you well, guys have any other specials going on? Um, well, we got we got fifty percent off for the elderly, and uh, okay. uh, 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 that that's about it so far. Gotcha. Okay. We just opened up. My name's Arthur Bennett. I'm the new manager here. Oh, gotcha. Okay. What's well, your name? Bryce. Uh, it's Bryce. Oh, Bryce, nice to meet you. Yeah, you as well. Are nice. you uh, from around here? Oh, yeah, I was born and raised over here in Sandy Shores. Oh, okay. Very cool. Yep, I spent my whole life out here enjoying it. That's, I mean, that's great. I mean, it must be if you're still here. Oh yeah, it's been a good life. I was I was in retirement for a little bit, but then I, I, I got bored. And I tried to build a rocking chair and it didn't work. So I figured this would be a good gig. <laughs> I, yeah, if you enjoy it. But it's I think it's important to kinda stay busy, even if it's just a little bit. Oh yeah, yeah, definitely it's 
It's always nice to get out here and meet new people. Is, have you met Seymour over here? Uh, no, I don't believe what? I have. What? What? Huh? Huh? Hold on, let me turn up my hearing aid a little bit. What? What were, what were you saying? Oh, have you met Bryce here? I, I don't think so. Yeah, the price is right. Uh, it well, that rhymes. <laughs> uh, but oh. nice, nice to meet you. Is, is she the one that invented the TV show? It, uh, no, no. Did you oh, the, did oh. you invent the TV? Uh, no, no, definitely not. Oh, okay. No, where I'm not, uh, where not are you from now. here, Bryce? Uh, well, I was born and raised down in the city, but, you know, came up to the county a couple of years ago. Oh, okay. What brought you up here? Uh, just trying to get away from some bad people down there. You know, wasn't living the best life, so oh, met no, that's some new not friends good. up here. And... Yeah, I like the uh, the quiet side of things. Yeah, it's nice and quiet up here. Although I will say the crime rate has has gone a little bit higher out here in the county. Yeah, that's true. But I mean, compared to the city, and it's I don't know, it's, it's not too bad. All these young whippersnappers out here in their in their in their ictots, in the birdies, in the bees. Uh, yeah, yeah. I mean, it's uh, there is quite a few young people around here. I was actually quite surprised when I moved here. Yeah, there's a lot of young whippersnappers out. I had somebody come over here, and he 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 hit my car, and, and then he oh. tried to hit me. Oh, yeah. That's I told him I might good. be old, but I'll still whoop your ass. <laughs> I, I'm sure. I'm very very sure. I mean, like. Did he actually hit your car? Oh yeah, he hit the side of it. Oh, it's a big old dent in yeah. it. That's that not good. Wrong. He didn't even have a beer. He just had a chuck. He came in here asking about chocolate milk. I told him this is a bar, Sonny. We don't sell chocolate milk here. Oh yeah, that's that's kind of a weird request. He said like the previous owner used to sell chocolate milk or something. I don't know. What do he look like? Oh, some young whippersnapper. He, he smelled real nasty. I think his name was like Gary or something. Oh, okay. All right. Well, uh, did he talk kind of funny? Yeah. He, yeah. Matter of fact, disrespectful punk. He kept talking about my mother. Something about oh. I'm gonna go see your mom or something like that. Oh. Okay. I, I told yeah, him my mom's been dead actually. for 30 years. Yeah, I, uh, <laughs> well, I guess you could kind of say I got set up on a date with him once. Oh, really? Something. Oh, yeah, down in the city. Oh, I bet you that was one of the worst dates you've ever had. It was something. Yeah, I mean, overall, it. It could have gone worse. It definitely wasn't great. Yeah, there was some big guy here with, like, suspenders and a big old gut. And then a shirtless man came here. I told him no shirt, no shoes, no service. Oh, I know who you're talking about. Yeah. Well, yeah, the, uh, ironically, the suspenders, I, uh, the ex-fiance of mine. Oh, really? Oh, yeah. Oh. Well, I'm sorry. No, I mean, it's, it's fine. We're, you hey, know, what did you say your name was? Bryce. Bryce. Uh-huh. Bryce. Did you yeah. just own this place? Oh, yeah. With, uh, with little Bill. Oh, yeah. I still do, technically. Oh. Whoa, well, it's nice to meet you. Uh, yeah, you as well. well. Yeah, did uh, Sandra hire you on? Oh, yeah, Sandra. 
She told me that they needed a new manager out here, so here I am. Nice. Well, I mean, we can definitely use the help for sure. So, welcome. Oh, thank you so much. Yeah, I'm going to try and take care of the place as best as I can. Oh, well, a, t a lot of stuff has gone down here, so I'm sure you'll do just fine. Oh, yeah, they have already had the craziness. Uh, that, that Carrie guy, he, he got a call hazmat for the bathroom back there. Oh, God. <laughs> yeah, I can only imagine. Yeah, it's been kind of crazy. For, well, then Seymour came in. Seymour came in here. He seems like a nice guy. Yeah, yeah. Ain't that yeah, right, I'm... Seymour? Yeah. Huh? Huh? What? What? What about hey, fries? Wait. No, I don't want any fries. What? What? Fries? Why are you crying? Fries? What? What about flies? Oh no, we don't have any flies. Oh, thank goodness. How's That's your cool. whiskey doing there? Can I top y'all? Uh, yeah, I'll take one more. Alrighty. What about you, Seymour? Uh, no, no, I'm, I'm about to get out of here, I think. I, I gotta go, I gotta go mow my lawn. Alrighty, hey, you be careful with that hip now, okay? Yes, yes, you as well, All Arthur. Right. It was nice meeting you. I, yeah. I'll see you again real soon, I'm sure. Nice meeting you, too. Take care Have now. Y'all come back Do -do -do. now. Let me just get that whiskey for you there, ma'am. Oh, yeah, I appreciate it. Here you go. Oh, thank you. Yeah, no problem. Yeah, so we got free pool and free darts tonight. You know, kind of like a grand reopening, I guess. Yeah, I mean, it's not bad to run specials, so that's perfect. Yeah, you know, the, we ran the specials out here, and like I guess then we got the free jukebox. Yeah, we probably should get some more music in there. Yeah, probably so, but the, it's got a good selection so far. It, well, it could be worse. It could be broken. Yeah, it could be way worse, yeah. We could have no music in here. That'd be kind of boring. Mm -hmm. Yeah, definitely. What's a bar without music, you know? Oh, yeah. If I'm it's too quiet, I'm, it's weird. I'm hoping maybe we can get a chef in here and maybe get some food rolling out. Yeah, well, we've got the flat top over there, so you're more than welcome to use it. Yeah, that's... Something definitely right now all we could do is just microwave popcorn. Can I interest you in some? No, I'm, I'm, I'm good. Thank you. All right. Well, it, it, it's there if you want some. I, well, I appreciate it. That's for sure. So, uh, th th that whiskey will be, uh, uh, 450. All right. Yeah, definitely. Man, yeah, go ahead and keep the change. Oh, thank you. I appreciate that. Yeah, for sure. Yeah, thanks for the uh, the drinks and all that and the conversation. Yeah, no problem. You have yourself a great day. Yeah, thank you so much. You as well. Yep, Hopefully it yep. gets uh, busier here for you. Hopefully so. All right. We'll see you around. Yep, take care. Y'all come back now, you hear? <laughs> Of course, Bryce had to come check out the Yellow Jack. There you go, Moon. That's the, uh, I mean, Mars. That's the, uh, that's, um, Bryce had to come back and check on her bar. I figured it'd bring out a, it'd bring in a little bit of business, you know?
Yellow Jack hasn't burned down yet. Not when, not whenever I'm in charge. <laughs> Fabric glue? That's a thing? <clears throat> Excuse me. That's not it. We'll just do the broom again. That conversation with Seymour was actually pretty cool. <laughs> I, had a, I had a good time with Seymour. That was fun. I, I Seymour was pretty cool. Oh, Jeff is Elio. Okay. Looks like a lot of people are in the city, apparently. So that's cool. A lot of people in the city. 1026 right now, but I need to finish the base. I have no idea how to make that stuff. Y'all are crazy. Like, y'all are super creative if y'all can do that. I could never do something like that. I, I suck at arts and crafts. I can't draw nothing. It's just... We have one person. Kyle is ladder two. Alright, what else did I miss? Did I miss anything else in the Arthur and Seymour best friends? Yo, you ain't lying. I wish I you know I should have got Seymour's number. Oh, but he wouldn't have a cell phone. That's yeah, that's the thing, is that we're old, so we don't have cell phones. Damn. Yeah, fuck that. I wouldn't know the first name. Mo Moron. Wow. Not smartphones, no. But that's the thing, is that... If I wanted to give somebody my number, I would have to pull out my, my cell phone. I know that's right. You're crazy for doing that in your bed. So yeah, I'm having a good time with this. Oh, looks like ladder two is getting dispatched. I heard something backfire. Well, that was cool that Peach. That was cool that Peach came out. So you RP it as a flip phone. Ah, good point. Good point. Good point. Good point, BP. That's actually not that bad. That's actually pretty good. I did not even think about that. 
I'm gonna have to try that out. This thing is built like a fucking tank. You can't even tell he did any damage to it. Oh, my speed limiter is still on. Yes, let's go. My speed limiter is still on. <laughs> this is so great. You know what? Let's go mess with Bella. Protest? What? A protest. What the fuck? Let's go mess with Ella. I know she's doing San Andreas Highway Patrol. Just because that's all she ever plays. That's the only LEO she does. San Andreas Highway Patrol. So, so let's go find her. Let's go, uh... Let's go find her and then let's go... Mess with her. Oh! What? What did she say? Oh, this is gonna take fucking forever. Is she actually as scary? Uh, actually, a scary IRL as an RP. Um, so I haven't met her IRL, but freaking Ella's, Ella's cool as shit. She's a. Uh, Her, her RP and her personality are two totally different things. She's, she's, she's nice. She's nice as hell. She's actually pretty cool outside of, uh, OCRP. Oh my gosh, this is going to take forever to get anywhere. <laughs> no, I am quite positive she hasn't killed any dogs for real. I don't think so, at least. Like I said, she's definitely a nice person outside of RP. She's she's super chill.
Alright, let's call this in. Also, 961, extremely slow driver on Route 13. Channel switched. We do not emergency port. God oh, dang! And I'm in the fast lane too. Like that just makes it even worse. <laughs> that just makes it even worse. I'm in the fast lane doing 16. Senator, this guy's not gonna help you. Hey, how's it going? Um, hey man, there's like this this guy, he's driving extremely slow in the fast lane over here on uh, Route 13. Okay, you have a description of the vehicle? Yeah, it's a, it's a black and color Lincoln Town Car. Like you said, uh, Route 13, what's the direction of travel? Uh, they're heading northbound. They're kind of coming up to the, uh, to the Ron silos. Uh, I guess it'll be, uh, what would this be? Joshua? Joshua in Route 13, I think? Okay, I'll have someone out to you as soon as possible. Alrighty, sounds good. Yeah, like I said, he's just in a black Lincoln Town car, just driving super slow. He's, uh, he's coming up to the Sandy Shores exit now. Okay, well, I'll have someone around as soon as possible. Alrighty, thank you. Yeah, have a good one. You too. Channel switched. That ought to get somebody over here. Ooh. Your comments. What do you mean? God, I really hope they call Ella up here. I can't wait to fuck with Ella. At this point, you switch the fast lane. <laughs> Yo, you ain't lying. Oh, we made it to the grape seed turn. Made it to the grape seed turn off. Have you ever heard of kick? Kick? Have you ever heard of that? Oh my goodness, my hair is a mess.
Because it was a car towing a trailer. What the fuck? A car towing a trailer? That's crazy. Yeah, unfortunately, that's the thing about start starting over on a new streaming platform. Like I told you, you got to go through the whole, uh, you got to go through the whole, you know, rebuilding your fan base type of thing. Yeah, kick streaming. What did you, what were you talking about? What are you talking about, BB? let dispatch know that I am continuing past the tunnels still northbound yeah best um Best to get some sleep and start over on it tomorrow, like on a fresh, uh, fresh eyes and fresh head. I know sometimes you want to get a task done and, you know, make sure it gets done, but sometimes it's better to start over and come out on a fresh head with it. Damn, at this point, I'm gonna end up fucking... At this point, I'm gonna end up in damn uh, Polito Bay. I'm a bat. <laughs> No cops, I guess. We'll see. We'll continue going down this path. I really want Ella to try and pull me over. <laughs> that person got tired of that. Like, fuck this guy. <laughs> Completely rather like I am tired of this shit. I mean, we'll wait and see, I guess. 
see if they can get me somebody dispatched out here. I know Ella's gotta be doing, uh, Oh, Ella's actually live. Yeah, so I know Ella's fucking LEO tonight. Time to go southbound. Yeah, she streams every now and again. She usually only streams on like Fridays or Saturdays. I don't know what she's, I don't know if she's, you know. Usually she's San Andreas Highway Patrol, so I don't know. Let's see what happens. Oh, what the fuck was that? Dude, look at this line of cars just building up. Check that out. It's gonna take more than that little fucking blip. What the fuck? <laughs> hey, sir, everything alright today? Oh! What? Everything okay? What? Hold are on, let me turn okay? my hearing aid up! Yeah, that might help. What? What did you say? Are you okay, sir? Oh my god, dude, why are you yelling at me? I'm gonna turn it down just a tad bit. What now? Alright, sir, is there a reason why you drive so huh? slow on the road? What? Alright, go ahead and step out of the vehicle for me, sir. Oh! What you saying? 
Can you step out of the vehicle for me? I can't hear you! Hold on! What now? I got read this paper. Oh, what? Why do I need to get out of my car? Because uh, you're, you're driving slow, sir. So you're, you're impeding traffic a little bit. Okay, I'm, I'm an old man. Yeah, exactly, sir. Okay, so why do I gotta get out of my car? What did it's, I do? It's not safe with you behind the wheel, sir. What do you mean? You're driving a slim, slow rate of uh, speed. And cars coming behind you probably can't stop at top. I've been driving since before you were a scratch in your daddy's left pocket. Awesome. Congratulations, sir. What? Uh, you are impeding traffic by driving slow, sir. There's a bit this... of a speed here, 35. And you're doing five miles per hour. Uh... This is a, this is elderly abuse. Hey, it's not elderly abuse, sir. You're abusing me. No, I'm not, sir. Can you can you step out? And come back here to my cruiser. Oh. Can you step All out of the right. vehicle for me? Yeah, just just come back here for me. Not in the road. Back on this side. Over here. Over here, sir. What? On the side of the road. Yeah, just right here, okay, for me? Oh, okay. All right, so, so what's going on today? Where are you heading to? I'm just out for a cruise, enjoying the scenery. Out for a cruise, enjoying the scenery? Thank God, there's no problem with that. But there is a problem with your speed, sir. Going, going under 35 is dangerous. And somebody can come around the corner back there and not realize you're going what? that slow with rear engine. He's speaking to my right ear. Yeah, I am speaking into your right ear, sir. Where your piece is. Huh? You might want to turn your hearing aid up just a little bit more. What? All right, sir. Can you hear me? Oh, I can hear you. So, the issue we have today, the reason for the stop, is your speed. You're traveling under 35. Okay. And we can't have that. All right. So, it's unsafe conditions. Uh, can I go and get your name for me? License? My name's Arthur Bennett. Arthur Bennett? Okay, Mr. Bennett. Do you want to uh, have a seat in my vehicle? Get you on the road. Well, can, I, can I have a seat in my vehicle? Yeah, I got Arthur. I got Arthur Phoenix seats in there. That's right. Have a seat in your vehicle, but I'm gonna take your keys. Oh. Uh, okay. All right. You get your vehicle, and I'm gonna get your keys from you. There you go. Arthur, here's my, here's my driver's license. I'll be right back, Professor. Please. A R T H E, yeah, yeah. I'm done, question mark?
I hope he lets me go. Because I have another scene actually lined up after this. One last scene. One last scene after this. Sir. Yeah. Alright, here's your license back. All right. I have two licenses on file. One's rejected, one's approved. The approved license is the most recent one, okay? Oh yeah, I just got it renewed at the DMV. Okay, you might need to go back down to the DMV and have them check off that rejection once it goes further confusion, okay? Oh, okay! Secondly, if you could speed it up to 35 or above, Yeah, yeah, I, I can do that. Alright, I'm gonna let you go with a uh, written warning today. Uh, here's your keys. You can uh, sign the bottom of this piece of paper. Yeah, if you sign the bottom of this right here, it's a written warning saying that I did stop you. Alright. Alright, 35 and above, sir. Keep it in the right lane. Okay. Stopped again, sir. They're gonna uh, they're gonna make you take a cab. Okay. Oh, okay. All right, sir. Have a good day. Thank you. All right, he let me go, which is cool. So now we got one more scene. This will probably be the last scene of the night. I am pretty tired. I gotta wake up tomorrow as well. I got a couple things to do. Got my haircut appointment. I gotta go pick up my order from Walmart. So, we'll see what happens. Goddamn hooligans! <laughs> No Sonic. What?
was gonna go a 10. Yeah. I remember that. It's now 11 to 1. <laughs> eh, figures. We just gotta get to the, to the Sandy Shores gas station. If we can get to Sandy Shores gas station, we got one more scene. Oops. Moon will go Moon will go to sleep as soon as my stream is done, I bet. I hope. <laughs> she needs there Moon, you need some sleep. Moon, if you want to stick around to the end of this scene, I'm cool with that cuz after this I will be ending it. But yeah, after this scene, I think I'm probably going to call it a night. All right, looks like we got 
Help, I've fallen and I can't get up. <laughs> exactly. Exactly what we're doing. This is so fun. Old man RP is freaking hilarious. Looks like we got somebody at rescue two, maybe like a rescue two and also a station two. So we'll see what happens. See if maybe they come over here. Hey, wake up! Oh, join on one one center. Channel switched. Nine on one, which emergency? Um, hey, how's it going? This is Jeff with Life Alert. We have a Life Alert button that has been triggered at the 24 7 in Sandy Shores. It's at 10 36, 1 0 A Life Alert for a 75 year old male. Name of Arthur Bennett is registered to this Life Alert button. Oh, yeah, just confirming you said the 24-7 uh, postal 1036. That is correct. It looks like the life alert is coming from 1036. All right, what's the time lapse? Um, Probably about two minutes now. All right, we'll send someone as soon as possible. All righty, thanks. Thanks, have a good one. Channel switched. I wasn't trying to... Uh... His head is gone. No, my, my head's still there. Um, I wasn't trying to do 911. That was basically like just a life alert, a life alert burden. It should automatically alert law enforcement and um, EMS. At least that's what I thought. But they said they needed. So I think they're so they're training somebody. So that's um. They're training somebody, so that's why I think they wanted the 911. That's why I was like, oh, hey, this is Jeff from Life Alert, you know? Give him something. Oh, from the angle? Yeah, from the angle it does, yeah. All in all, I think I would say this is a pretty eventful, uh, pretty eventful night of RP. It's been chill. Like, it hasn't been crazy RP. It's actually been pretty chill and tamed. Um, I kind of enjoyed tonight. What do y'all think, chat? Do y'all usually, I mean, I know usually y'all want to see the crazy, you know, getting a shootout and chase, chase and stuff, but... You know, stuff like this, I think is actually fun to do too. Like, it's fun to have scenes like these where they're not always so crazy. You can just kind of kick back and chill and have a good time with it. Even though it's been chill, I have been able to come up with some RP ideas. Yeah, chill yet chaos. It's chill, but there's been some of those times where it's like, you know... It's a nice change of pace every once in a while. Exactly. That's why I was like, you know what? Like, I think tonight I just want to come in and do something chill and relaxing. And, you know, of course, I wanted to start the 24-7. That was, like, the main thing. I wanted to get the 24-7. We had a couple customers come in, and I'm happy with that. I am totally cool with that. I had a good time with the 24-7. Seymour fucking killed it. So, shout out Seymour. 
Um, even Bryce came in and made an appearance. That was pretty cool. And then we're giving the county folks some stuff to do too because I don't know if there's anything really going on in the county, but there's only four county units. So it gives the county unit something to do. Wayne County, sir, can you hear me? Hey, can you hear me? Hey, can you want to get how far out is Phoenix? Yeah, four four five. I saw him going back towards Panorama when I was entering twenty four seven. Probably long gone by now. Copy. Sir, can you hear me? Sir, we've got EMS coming. Uh, just stay, just try and we'll see if we can wake you up, man. <laughs> Sir, can you hear me? <laughs> you fell over. Hey, go ahead. Hey man, we got EMS coming to be about two minutes. Can you tell me what uh, what you last happened? What you last saw oh. before you blacked out? Oh. Oh, it's... Yeah. Floor's weird. Oh my yeah. goodness, my voice is not coming I mean, through. It looks like you got reason. like a, a, a bang, a knock to your head. You got a little cut to it. Um, Ew, EMS should be here in the I've time. fallen yeah, and I can't get up. Yeah, we'll we'll try it. We'll try to set you up at least. All right. You think you can do that? Oh, I can try. Yeah, look, I'll, I'll try and help oh. you set up. All right, how are you feeling, man? Looks like you took oh, a puncture. My head hurts. Yeah. Hey, over here. Hey, what's going on? He um he slipped over and knocked his head on the uh, shelf here. Help. He's got a cut I'm inside falling his head. and I can't get up. Um, I got him <laughs> to sit up just to see that see how bad the cat cut on the side of his head is, but it's not that bad. Um, okay. He's now conscious. He was unconscious when I came in. So. Alrighty. Hey, sir. My name is Firefighter Andrew Hill with the San Andreas Fire Rescue. How are you doing today? What? How, how are you doing today? Oh, my head hurts. I I see that. I I hear you had a slip. Is that is that accurate? Yeah, I slipped on the wet floor. I hit my head on the shelf there. Oh, my head hurts. Okay. All right. Yeah, I'm just gonna look over your head real quick. Do you do you can you tell me what your name is? Arthur Bennett. All right, Mr. Bennett. It looks like you got a little bit of blood here from from a little cut. Um, let me go ahead and I'm gonna put a bandage on that. Do you do you happen to know what today is? Uh, is it 
do things. No, sir, it is not Tuesday. Are you are you currently on any type of medication for maybe memory or anything like that? No. Okay, you're not on any medication for injury or for memory. No, I don't have. I might be old, but I remember things. I I believe you, sir. I believe you. Do you know what year it is by chance? Um. Uh, I don't remember. Okay. All right. And okay. That's that's all right. Do you are you having any pain in your legs or feet or anything like that? Oh, I got knee pains. Are are those knee pains from prior to you coming into the store from a oh, prior my injury? Oh, knees are always hurting. Okay. All right, sir. Are you able to? Are you able to uh, stand up? Do you do you happen to know where you are by chance? Um, um, I remember I was in the twenty four seven. Do you know what town? Um, I think I was in Sandy. The, yes, sir. You are in the twenty four seven in Sandy Shores. That's very good. What I'm going to have you do now is we're, me and this officer are going to slow, or sorry, this deputy are going to slowly, slowly help you up to your feet, and I'm going to walk you out to the ambulance so I can check you a little bit further, okay? Okay. My hip right. hurts. Oh, okay, is that hip from a pre-existing injury, or? No. Okay, I'm going to, I'm going to take a quick look at that hip, okay, before we have you stand up. Okay. All right, sir. It looks like it looks like you just have a little bit of a bruise here. Um, what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna go out and get the backboard out of my uh, out of my ambulance. I'm gonna put you on that backboard, and we'll uh, we'll carry you out to the to the ambulance. Okay. All right, then. All right, just hang tight. Can you hang tight with him real quick, deputy? Yeah. Yeah, yeah, I appreciate it. Um, oh, where did you come from? Sir, I've been here the whole, the whole, been here the whole time, sir. Oh, what? Yeah, I was the one that I can't came to your him. aid. The one that came here to your aid while you were on the floor. What? Um, you got to speak up, you, Sonny. I can't hear. Came, came here to help you, sir. Oh, oh, thank you. Um, since you'll be going to the hospital with this fine medic, do you, what do you want me to do with your car? You want me to have it taken to your house, or oh, do you want it's... us to take it to the town lot so you can pick it up later? Yeah, can you take it to my house, please? Yeah, we can have Ty take it there. I appreciate that, Sonny. All right, yeah. sir. Can you before we before we get you lifted or anything like that? Can you move your Can you move your leg a little bit? The one with the the and or the the side that you have your hip injury on. Can you just wiggle that for me? Okay. Yeah, that looks that looks good. Are you having any major pains with that as you move that? Okay, just a little bit, a little bit of discomfort over there in that hip. Yeah, just, just my, just my hip and my knees. Okay, all right. So what we'll do is we'll go ahead and we'll help you to your feet. I'm gonna have you sit on this stretcher over here and take you out to the uh, ambulance. Okay. Alrighty. All right, ready. On the count of three, right. we'll have you stand up. One, two, 
three. Nice and easy, nice and easy. Yeah. All right, let me help you over to this. Uh, oh. Help you over to this. Oh. Oh, 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 I got you. All right, let's just let's pick him up. We'll put his arms over our shoulders and just yeah. lay him on the ammo <laughs> or on the uh, stretcher. I'm falling and I can't get up. All right, we're gonna we're gonna pick your arms up I and we're just gonna do. lift you up. Ready? All right. One, two, three. Up we go. Yep. All right, and we'll put you on the uh, the stretcher here. I can't get 10 for it. Hey, I'm being dispatched to a uh, pursuit. Did All right, you're good. Me? Yeah, no, you're um, good. I appreciate the help. Okay, I'll come back for his car to site be take to his place. All right, sounds good. Stay safe. Yeah. All right, Mr. Bennett it was, right? All right, Mr. Bennett, would you prefer that I call you Arthur or Mr. Bennett? How would you like me to address you? It, you better show me some respect. I'm, I'm an elder. I, I understand that, Mr. Bennett. I will continue to address you as Mr. Bennett. All right, Mr. Bennett, what I'm going to do now is I'm going to just transport you over to uh, Sandy Medical. They'll, they'll have a look at you, check you out, and make sure you're good to go, okay? Oh, alrighty then. All right, just sit tight. Casually eats the floor. <laughs> yeah, no, there's no fucking way. Hold up, Nicole, you can't even ask for a 48-hour stream. You weren't even there for the 24-hour stream. What the hell? It doesn't work that way. I'm going to have a lot of people to uh, to think in Discord after this on the uh, Praise Your Peer section of OCRP. Hmm. All right, Mr. Bennett. I'll tell you what, the, the folks here at Sandy Medical are going to take real good care of you. They got you up here in this uh, this third room right here. And uh, they'll make sure that you get checked out. They'll take an x-ray of that hip and uh, make sure that you don't have any severe issues, okay? Alrighty, I appreciate that, Sonny. Yes, sir, Mr. Bennett. You take care and be a little, be a little more careful in those uh, 24-7s. They're death traps, okay? Yeah, yes, yep, will do. Alrighty, have a good day. Take care now. You too. That was fun. This was a lot of good RP tonight. Had a lot of fun. I had a lot of fun with even just this chill RP. That was a lot of fun tonight all right everybody i am out of here i am gone for the night i appreciate everybody who came to hang out with me tonight thank y'all so much um thank y'all for sticking with me uh thanks for hanging out with me even though it was like i said it was just a kind of a chill stream something just nice and chill a couple laid back chill rp um, we will see y'all tomorrow for sure, so be sure to hit that notification bell if you haven't already. Um, and we will see y'all tomorrow afternoon for uh, a new game to the jam to the, to the channel. Uh, we're gonna be doing Red Dead Redemption uh, two, and then we will also continue with some Life is Strange. So until then, we will see y'all next time. I appreciate everybody. See you later.